1,500 meters. It's going to be three Ethiopians out on the front, but the Kenyans are coming as well. Uh, it's uh, Mary Ekuru. I spoke about her. She's uh, one of the big favorites. If anyone is going to stop the Ethiopians from doing a 1 2 3, it's going to be Mary Akiru, but the Ethiopians are out on the front. And they are with Harris Bishasha. And they are spreading to the outside to prevent her from flanking through the outside. As Just well as Ambezu as they come to the bend. It is Mishasha in the lead at the moment. But Mary Ekuru is coming out strongly with about 100 meters to go. She's going on the outside. Mary Ekuru, Meshasha can see her from the outside of her eye. She's going past the first Ethiopian. Oh, but she cannot do it. Ethiopia is going to do a one-two. And uh, Mary Ekuru will have to settle for the bronze medal because Meshasha has executed a flawless race to win gold for Ethiopia and a country woman. Um, Besu also coming through. It's actually Howie Abera who's come through with the silver medal. Well, and Mary Akeru will have to settle. Well, here for on the finish of the bronze. The um, and quite clearly, Meshesha kicked at the very last moment. Kenyan trying to get past. But there was no way she was beating the first and the second one. Uh, but eventually she managed to knock herself, nudge herself into a bronze medal position. The whole plan at this stage was for the Ethiopians to have shut out the Kenyan. At some point they spread themselves out to try to prevent her from coming down the flank. And in the end, Meshesha taking the gold, uh, Howie Abera um, taking the silver, and Mary Akiru having to settle for bronze. Well, there was no catching Meshesha there once she took off and for... Uh... Abera himself, uh, she could see Mary Akuru coming and she just stepped into another gear. Brilliant medal for Ethiopia again.